another deal once again the skin to me it looks like um walgreen this week said you know what i'm gonna catch up to cvs because this is another deal here as well so the deal here is so you have to spend twenty dollars see you guys this is a spend deal so you have to spend twenty dollars and get five thousand points and these coupons there's one on the app but if you don't have it then you can also get it at six seven ss so that is this sunday's paper so if you need them or you want them you get them so one of the deals that i wanted to do is gone guys you see it and it gives you two thousand points back so the palmolive 20 ounce they're on sale buy two for 3.98 on Palmolive website, so you have to go on their site, palmolive.com, there's a 25 cents coupon. So if you use one, you get, you're gonna pay 349, but you're gonna get back, I'm sorry, 348, and you're gonna get back 2,000 points, um, making them final cost a dollar 48, or just 74 cents each. And it's the 20 ounce, guys, because, and I just wanted to show you the coupon, okay? So you got to go on their website to get this coupon. Good morning. So today is Thursday and I did this haul Wednesday. I told you guys that I will go for part two and I did. And I also did it because I wanted to test myself and become better at this thing where um, it's funny because I was watching another blogger on her video and she's been couponing for a long time, just like I have. And she just found out about the spend and uh, the spend deal to get points and still get points and pay with points. Uh, we went over that on the Walgreen video that I did on Sunday. And I just want to get the hang of it because I'm a person that when I want to know something and I want to get it down packed, I'm going to practice it and practice it. So I wanted to go for part two because I wanted to do the skin to mid razor, but I also wanted to do the spend and get points and then pay with points. So I did it again. And also I wind up going back for the Colgate, although I did it before, but that coupon that I clipped $5 did not go through. Although the manager honored it to me, it was still there. So I said, you know what, then I'm going to take advantage of it. I'm not trying to cheat. It's just that if it's there, why let it sit there? So I started going into which are the toothpaste that qualify, and I hit it right on the nail, and this is the one that qualifies. So I the $5 off of three came off. And then, remember what I told you guys, when I make a mistake, I fix it. I also had saw that these skin cement were supposed to be buy one, get the second 50% off. So all you had to do was spend 20 on these to get $5. So if you spend, uh, it's $8.49, $8.49, and then the $4 and change, uh, 24 cents, um, you were supposed to, there you were spending 20 plus. So that gave you eligibility to do it. So that's why I did three. I had uh, one of my viewers, um, she questioned me about it and she said, that she was trying to make a deal. Um, I believe her name is Lorena. She was trying to make a deal online and the BOGO was not coming out. So when she reached out to me and comment on the video, I answered her back. So I said, you know what? Let me make sure because that day I did not do it. I did not do this deal. And I said that I will be back for it. Um, so what I did was I was at work and I wind up calling the store that I normally shop and I called the manager. And the manager put me on hold and I told him, scan them to see if they go through. I specifically told him which one they were. He repeated it back to me. So we were talking about the same thing and he did tell me that yes. So I answered Lorena back and I said, yes, I called the store and they are Bogle. But guess what guys, when I went to the store, they were not Bogle. And I didn't notice that until after the receipt, but it fixed itself because I clipped the $6 coupon on these. Okay, so the $6 for two. So obviously I could not give her another $6 because I was getting three. I would have had to gotten four. So when I told her as 
the employee was ringing on my transaction. I said, did the $6 come off? Every time I asked if all my coupons came off before they pressed total, and she said the skin to me did not come off. So I wasn't going to fuss. I had just came out of work. I was tired. It was pouring outside. So I said, you know what? I have a manual one. I'll just give it to you. And I gave it to her. So guess what? When I looked at my, my receipt, as I was sitting in my car, I noticed that the bogle did not come out. And then I said, oh, here I go again. I'm going to have to either go back inside or call customer service. So I did neither because as I was looking at my receipt, the $6 that I clipped did come off but also the $6 that I gave her manually. So you see how it kind of worked out? But it was funny because it's not supposed to because the other $6 is for two more when I only got three. So it's like if I had four, the six came off. And I'm going to show you. I wanted to tell you my story, but overall, like I told you, I'm the fixer. It came out well. Because, you know, I always include the tax. I don't do that subtotal shit. It's $28.58, all of this that I pay out of my pocket. It was way more expensive, of course. And um, I wind up getting this $4 right here. And that was for the Colgate. And then I wind up getting 20,000 points. And how I got that, I'm gonna break it down in the receipt and explain it to you. Okay, guys, so here. So you see the date? It was yesterday's date. And look, the, look at the time, seven o'clock. I was tired. Okay, so the Colgate, again, $2.99. So I got three of them because that is the deal to get three of them and it, it comes out to $8.97 and then I got the Schicks, two of them. She rung up two because they were two of the same, $8.49 and then she rung up the other one single because it's a different one, $8.49. Okay, that went well. Then I went to do this gel because I want to give this to my husband as a whole package. So I already got the razors and I got him these right here. This is the shave gel and this is the face wash. Okay. So that one came out to $7.99, the gel, shave gel, and $12.99 was the face wash. So here goes my coupon, guys. You see how it did come off? This is the one I clipped off, the $6. Because you can tell because it, it says skin to me when you give them manufacture paper it'll say manufacture so there goes my six here goes the uh, colgate again you see you clip it so it says colgate so there goes the five dollars and then here goes this i clipped as well it was four dollars for the face wash so here it is uh here it is again the shave one two dollars so since these are all the ones i clipped it tells you the name so therefore she was wrong she didn't she told me it didn't come off but it did then i gave her there goes that six dollars right here manufacture you see because i thought since she told me no so i gave it to her. i wasn't going to lose out then i gave her four dollars in catalina and i gave her another four dollar the register reward so in total i gave her 31 in coupons so because this was a spend right spend 20 and get 10,000 points you have to use that same amount in coupons so they can go in as cash and please guys if you don't understand i'll try my best to explain it again um it took me time to understand it so i i had in in coupon which is worth cash um even more than what the spend deal was as long as you go i guess over 20 um, so my subtotal was $24.42. There goes my tax. So I spent out of my pocket $28.58. I redeem 10,000 points because I have 15,000, but you can't do 15. You have to do 10. So I did 10, okay? So um, out of pocket, I wind up spending $18.58, guys. So that's what really came out of my pocket because of the fact that I redeemed the 10,000 points. Give me one second, guys. I'm back, guys. I apologize. So, therefore, what I spent out of my, my own pocket was $18.58. So, look at this, guys. I started off with my opening balance was $10,000. Oh, I thought I had fifteen. dollars I was wrong. And um, in bonus, I got 20,000 points. So, how did I get 20,000? I got... The 10,000 for the King Gillette. 
I got the 5,000 for the skin to mint, but I had clipped on Saturday last week, uh, spend 20 and get 5,000 points. So you got to be careful with that one because that one, it, it has nothing to do with the coupons that you're going to be using. So you literally do have to spend that much in order to get that 5,000 points. But I did. Clearly I did. So I got that extra 5,000. So I got 20,000 points. So now I'm at 21. I started at 10 and now I'm at 21. So I'm double from what I started with. Okay. So, and then I got my $4 for the Colgate. So in all in all, out of pocket was $18.58, guys. I got back 24. You saw the 20,000 points on my receipt. You saw the $4 on the reward. So that was $24. So this was actually a money maker of $5.42. And this is including tax. Okay, I don't take out the tax. It's included. It's still coming out of my pocket. So money maker of $5.42. And this is what I got. I had wanted to go do the skin submit and I went back to do it. Now, what I could not do was the palm olive, but I'm not going to give up. I have until Saturday. I won't film it because it's just the palm olive, but you best to believe that I am going to go do it. I'll go to another one. I like that um, dishwashing liquid. So don't forget to like, comment, share, new viewers, subscribe, and tap that bell for post notification. And I did go back to CVS as well.